Hello everyone, I am Kichigo and welcome back to a new episode of Dishonored. So last time we were betrayed, uh, we got found by Daw's man, uh, we confronted Daw, um, non-lethally, so we just stole from him without him knowing. So now we're on our way back to the pit hub, but since Samuel can't help us, we kind of have to go about it. Her own way and I the episode went too long so we kind of stopped I don't know maybe halfway or maybe it was right wait a minute so now we're just making our way back to where we need to go and there are that's 130 Okay, so it'll be the bone charm. Ooh, wait, this is a very derelict place, isn't it? I think we're still in the flooded district, though. Weepers. Okay. So maybe. Oh! Bone charm, six of eight. Tough skin, your max health has been slightly increased. Didn't we have that last time? So, did something get upgraded then? Like, maybe one of the ones that we already had? I guess so. Hmm. Nothing here. a window here. So wait, no, we still have the... Do I get closer to it? It probably was on the other side. I probably ran right past it. Oh. Is that... Well, both of these are kind of down. This is not a door. So... I must be able to go into a sewer or something like that. Wait. No, that's nothing. Okay, so then this, which Probably would make some noise. Oh my gosh. I didn't think there was going to run after me. Oh my god, that scared me. Come at me if you want to. Oh 
Oh my gosh. My heart is pounding. be able to get him. Or not. Ah, flies! Oh. This sucks. Okay, well. I really want to take ah flies. I might be able to get him. Okay, let's save. I mean, if worst case scenario, I'll just reload the first save. Oh God, reload. Yep. what I'm on top of. I don't know how you're not seeing me, but... Flies! Like, granted, that's the way I have to go, but at the same time, actually, okay, now it's just the ladies left. I might be able to bend t ugh, time. Um, is something. Can I do something that can cause noise? Well, you guys are just coughing and throwing up on each other, but I guess it doesn't really matter since you guys are both sick. That's where we have to go. And I think I got rid of oop dump the mic. Uh rid of everything. But man, I wonder if that was just part of the plot. Like you would have to um actually like you would actually need to make noise. So like they was gonna chase us anyway. Because they probably wouldn't. Well, 
Yeah, and there's no way to come in from the top, it doesn't look like. Even if I did go the other way through the window. Wait, hold on. Or maybe. Yeah, okay. So if I would have gone through the window, like I saw before, I could have avoided that whole thing. Yeah. Oh well. What's done is done. I still managed to get rid of all of them without having to use uh, items. Okay, so... Sewer entry. Hmm. Let's go where they were. Because I have a feeling that those were the only weepers. At least right here. So yeah, they were close enough. Okay. Nothing here. Aw, oh, one of the weepers died. I still don't feel comfortable eating anything that a weeper was trying to eat. But hey, at least it's not saying you got the plague now because you ate too much rotten food. Okay, so I'm guessing that there's nothing else then. Because I'm not seeing any other entrances. So, save that. Oh, we have to turn that. So really, there's no other way to get to... Man. Because I'm missing out on a room. But I don't know how to get to it. And I think that's basically it. Well, maybe it won't... Oh, this would have made some noise. Get in there! Uh, okay, hold on. Yeah, I feel like they would have eventually heard me. So they must be in here. Okay, bone charm. Let's take the higher ground. Yep. Definitely some more weepers. Okay. Oh. Right there? Or maybe that's just someone sick. Sewer gate. No. That's someone just sick then. So you might not mind. Wish I had a last swig of whiskey. I don't want you killing yourself. One oh, mass guys been taking down all the lords and ladies. No way through this gate unless you got the sewer key. Only one place to get that key, and I wouldn't go there. Not for all the gold in Dunwall Tower. Are there a lot of weepers? Guess. Maybe you could pull it off, though. Something attacked us in the distillery. It used the rats. I know it sounds crazy. And then it run back under the streets. So we come down here to kill it, Slackjaw leading the way. Oh. With that, I barely crawled out. Don't know what happened to Slackjaw. He had the sewer key, though. Oh no, is Slackjaw... Gone? It was Ooh. fog, and rats. Rats everywhere. Slackjaw chased them deeper into the sewers. 
So that's a combination of like the rap power that uh, you can decide to get. Is that something there? No. Um. All right. So. Surkey. Or maybe this turns us back into a circle then. Unless this is water down here. Well, yeah, it's, it's water, but I don't think it's deep enough to take me anywhere. Or maybe it is. That's where I have to go. So maybe it's on the other side of the the gate. Okay, so we have something that can use rats. Hmm, still nothing, which is good. Let me see if I can if I can stay up here. No, I can't stay up here. Did I just hear something? Okay, that's blocked. You know what? I think... Great. Okay, uh, let's try the signary boats. Remember this part real well either. Press over there. Looks like just one. And my heart is beating, so there is. Oh, there's some more river crest. Um. There's a body in the bathtub? Oh. Um, I only have two of these. Oh! 
Oh, he's breaking it. Well, thanks, I guess. So gross. I mean, I guess it's a good thing that Carvo does wear a mask. Maybe it protects him from all this that we subject him to. Oh wait, yeah, the money that I saw. Like, I'm not sure if it's like, was just the three of them that betrayed us, or if like, everyone, like... Well, I don't think so, because even half not Havelock, the Overseer was like... It made it seem like he was going to, like, punish or discipline uh, Callista because she probably was like would have been like I'm not serving you like why did you get rid of Carvo I don't know the music just got really suspicious okay it's just this book and this Jelly's next task you deaf chaffer here's another one for you that old witch granny rags told me that you'll lose your taste for whiskey in the month of wind and then your eyes will go dim in the month of seeds and you'll draw your last breath in the month of ice if you want your sh your share you know what to do so we have wind seeds ice wind seeds ice wind seeds ice wind so five two five to eight five to eight I think another born charm let's see what this one is plague affinity getting damaged by weepers gives a small amount of mana Unfortunately, I have not been damaged. Okay. Whew! Stress. The stress is real. Cause I'm not, like, do I remember the rat guy? Let me heal myself though. All right, let's go. Cause I feel like I have like a slight memory of it. A very slight memory. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them right there. Did I get everything back? No, okay, so those would probably be on the other side of the sewer the gate. Make one count. If it wasn't for the fact that 
or I can do the pistol and then slow down time enough. I have to get closer. Oh! Water. Oh crap, I can't, I can't. Well, let's just move away then. Is there anything there that I could get? Whoa! Mm, no, and this makes it really hard to see. Am I going down? Looks like I'm going down. Air pocket? Die. Ooh. I'm glad this is a sewer and not like, I don't know. I don't know why I'm pulling out that. Why? Oh, spring. Okay. Oh, Granny Rats is there. Boil off the nasty fat and sing it, and carve a pretty song on your bones. Hey! Someone kill this crazy witch! I could make you rich! Quiet now. Is Granny that a well? Rats, concentrate. Don't kill me. Granny Rat, stop. Stop what you're doing. Get a slack jaw? My knives gotta be nice and sharp to cut into your skeleton slack jaw. What? Nice and sharp. Hold on. Strange smelling. Strange smelling manor strip. A script from a titled manuscript, written in a scrawling hand, stronger than Scrimshaw, a skull full of guile, well bowed bones in a pile, white scrap gleaming, kindle fire and crackle fat, baked black gobs of spat, fume up, fume up, feathers, mad-eyed bird fell to the ground, seed, snittle, neat, neatly, knit, 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 knittle, see, stir a bit. Well, Granny, listen. Oh, there's my love. Hi. Are you ready to help get Slackjaw's bones? Granny has some birthday gifts for you. I've been saving them up in case you ever came back to me. Okay, Granny, I hope you. I mean, like, to be perfectly honest, Granny Rex has not been helpful to us. Like. Yeah, she gave us a rune or a bone charm during the first mission where we kept Slackjaw's people from messing with her. But, I mean, like, she wanted to, you know, 
give them the plague plus anyone else that bought from them any sh uh watch guards that would have taken the elixir thus spreading the plague further while slackjaw has helped us like at least during one mission so i don't think i'm gonna help her not going to help granny well i'm disappointed you better leave okay i'll leave uh, i'll leave so get the ma sewer master key from granny is it on her is it on her person it is on her person what the heck are you doing how do i get you out you cheating bastard you're down here too <laughs> The least you could do is help me out. You swindled me good, masked man. And all along, you were the same bastard who killed the Empress. Oh, yeah, Corvo. Word is all I didn't the kill street. the Empress, yo. All right, Granny Raz has to die. This is not my fight, but I'll consider it. What does this do? Will this let him go? Ah! What action do you think would make her go crazy? Do you think it would be the action of taking her key? Or would it be the action of releasing him? Oh no. Help! Okay. Find Grandy's cameo. Throw it into the furnace. Burn the cameo and you kill her. Oh. Just like all the others. <laughs> What's wrong? Can't you find me? <laughs> what is? Oh, rats! 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 Oh, there's more rats! Oh, crap! She has so many rats! Whoa! Ah! What is even going on? Hold! 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 Hold up. Okay, hold on. Okay, so I had the right idea. Um, get rid of the cameo, and then, um, and then choke Granny. So I might release him afterwards. But I am gonna save again, though, just to make sure. Okay. So what I plan on doing. Got the key. Oh no, don't. I'll kill you and cook you and eat your heart for breakfast. Look around. There's a cameo of a young girl. It's her. This is okay. Where is the cover? She's gonna be Elise up here. Bones of the great Leviathan. Okay, how do I oh. 
Burn it! Oh. Place great is Kameo. Oh! Explorer's Journal. A script from the Journal of an Explorer and Natural Philosopher. Um, Dr. Hazian's interpretations of the Pandician carvings are the height of ignorance. The core theme is not renewal, but dire, dire warning. The central figure is not a bending spirit, is clearly a monster, and the jewel a type of fetish, the key to his dark fantasy, perhaps. The panel should be read as follows. The hero figure steals the jewel from the monster and cast it into, cast it into an unquenchable fire. Thus, the monster is made mortal, and the hero is able to slay it, breaking the cycle of terror. Note is scrawled in the margins. Vera has taken an inordinate interest in my field manuals. Such appetites are assembly in the lady of her station. I shall have to reprimand her. Second note, written in a different hand. So dreary, dreary, dearie. Oh, so Vera is Granny Rags. And that's how we beat her. Outsider. Oh, sleep darts. Because they knew we was going to use them. Aw, man, that's a lot of fire. What's this? The Leviathan Sorrow, a script from a report on the treaties banned by the Rush Shore Trade Council. Pause if you would like to read it. Okay. Okay. Alright, anything else? Well, that's one way to get out, it looks like. Pick that up. Okay. Um, right, because we wouldn't be able to get back then, correct? Here's Stack Draw. Want to know something funny? Yes. When we were kids, we were all scared of Granny Rags. Thought she was a terrible witch. Well, she definitely was. Then we grew up and figured she was just a sad old lady. We were right the first time. Now ain't that funny? So, I wonder... I you, this won't even the score, but it's all I got left. Luck to you, Corpo. Luck to you too, Slackdraw. Street conspiracy. So... I guess because she did come from a noble family, right? So I wonder if. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Sorry. Um. Like, she was Vera first. Well, I mean, like, she's Vera. Um, regardless. Um. So. She got into the black arts, then, because he said that she loved the noble, because I think we found one of her diary entries in the noble area where the party was. So I'm just trying to, like, figure out the timeline. Like, I'm thinking that she was a noble first, then she moved out of the noble city, or maybe it was her finding out about the black magic. I don't know. Anyway... I do not remember that fight. Because I think they said, like, you can actually avoid the whole thing um, by, like, avoiding Granny Rags. Like, not doing any of her qu 
quest. So... Okay. It's telling me to go that way, so... Yeah. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think we can get back to where we were. But anyway, so... But I feel like I did do her quest, though, which is the weird thing. Or maybe I just killed her. Well, her Kameo is gone, so does that mean she won't be as crazy anymore? Okay, well, bye. Okay. So I'm hoping that we are heading... Okay. Looks like it. Our heart is beating. Just look at this area. Oh. Well, hold on. Oh, it's a shrine, so we're going to end up talking to the outsider. You find your way into such interesting places, Corvo. Don't I, though? At the eye of the storm, raging between granny rags and this man who has lived his whole life with a cleaver in one hand and a bottle in the other. Crawling out of those flooded ruins, winding your way back to the pub where you last saw Emily. Where is she now? I don't know. How does it feel now, knowing your allies betrayed you? Strange how there's always a little more innocence left to lose. And Dowd, the man who killed the Empress. You had him in the palm of your hand. And you let him walk away? You fascinate me. I wonder, does he say the same stuff like if you've been killing everyone? Like, oh, you fascinate me how you just been just killing everyone. Or does he say like, well, this is to be expected. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay, so which way are we going? Following the thingy? Oh. It's not letting me in! Oh god. Oh! Yeah, this is a relic. Oh. Oh. Oh! It's this! Okay. Alright. So, still don't answer my question about how to get over. It must be over there. The guy's gone. Maybe he got himself up. Interesting. Um, also, I'm going to save. So I don't have to do that whole fight again. Like, it's not like I did it uh, flawlessly, but I also don't want issues either. Okay. It must be down here. River crust. Oh, this those look like just regular people. So they probably not gonna attack me. I've heard that some have survived the plague. <laughs> those are river crust. <laughs> Out I Some people say the same stuff. I'm just like, how you guys all going through the same stuff? I want 
this. I have to keep this position. Can't get it. I think for this one it's just like I can't do weird stuff in front of them. Oh, there it is. Um. I told her to keep the children inside. I told her. Okay. Five out of five rooms. Yep. I'm pretty much done with what I'm trying to get. Oh, that would be really good though. If I do play this game a third time and kill everyone. Like having that ability to have them turn to ash so they won't even be a problem. And probably the Bowering Swarm. I think I would still kind of want Ben Time. Like Dark Vision, Blink, Ben Time. Like if I were to do like an Assassin. A lethal route. I would definitely do dark, blink, bend, devouring swarm, vitality because I probably actually need it, bloodthirsty, agility, and shadow kill. I'd probably end up doing the same stuff, but. But who wants to do it easy all the time? I don't need that. Uh, let's go this way. That's all that's here. So next is just the bone charm. Which might be just around that way. Because I can't get through here. But it's good that they have their own little spot. Like none of them seem sick, but I also don't know how they would, you know, get out of this predicament. Like, how do they get out and do other... Okay, it's by those... Why well, isn't this this great? Unfortunately... Still matters to hit me. I probably can just shoot this one. Open up, dude. Fishes. Oh, the fish died too? <laughs> Man, that explosion sent them flying. Excuse me? Okay. Uh, let's see. Alright, so it's not at the top, so it must have been... A part two, level two of one of the other ones. Okay. Oh. Let me back up, please. Um. Okay. have to oh I just do what says
side. Hooray! Okay, let's go. Well, not outside, just... Ooh! Pompous Pub. Oh. Okay. Flooded District. So, we got one unconscious body found. Uh, low chaos. Didn't kill anyone. Recovered your weapons and gear and helped Slackjaw defeat Granny. 5 out of 5 rooms. 8 out of... 8 out of 8 bone charms, 1 out of 1 outsider shrines, got all 3 circle of paintings, um, yeah, not all the coins, unfortunately. Alright, so this is what I was remembering when they was giving us the foreboding music. Oh! Hey, you! Let's... Mission clues. Uh, escaping the flooded district, you've returned to the section of the city where the Hound Piss pub is located. Start there to pick up the trail of your old allies and find out where they have taken Emily. And... You've returned to the Hound Piss pub to pick up the trail of your old allies and find out where... Yeah, okay, so it's just the same thing. Um, hello! Please, no! Oh, it's you, Corvo. Hi. I thank the stars. We all thought you'd been killed. Except for Samuel. He seemed sure you'd survive. I saw him on the river shortly before the killing began. He was smart enough not to come ashore. But I'll bet he's still out there. Looking for you is my guess. At first, Pendleton said it was time for our bonus. Havelock stood behind them, and at the signal... He shot them each in the back of the head. Just like the target drills he used to. Lydia barely had time to scream. I would be dead too. Except Wallace told me I wouldn't be getting anything. Pendleton kept apologizing. Saying that no one could ever know about the things they'd done. Martin was drinking and seemed sad. The Admiral was about to shoot Callista. Then he mumbled something about owing her uncle, Captain Kernow, a debt. They said it was time for Sokolov and went off to his cage. I don't know what happened after that. So wait, so does that mean that they killed like all the servants? Emily was there when the killing started. Oh, I didn't even click you. I hope she hit her eyes. The Admiral said that Martin was right. I guess they talked about it. And they started to worry they'd get executed for all that they'd done going after the Lord Regent and his allies. I suppose it's why they've poisoned you too. So, they killed all the servants. Um, probably Para, meaning that I probably won't even have anyone to buy stuff from. So, um, and then they also wanted to. Oh, it's the abandoned uh, place again. I thought Lydia would squeal on me at the end. Uh oh. She I. told Havelock to screw himself. Dude, there's tall, there are tall boys out there. Move! Jeez. Anyway. There are tall boys out there. What is this? Hey, oh, poor it's sure. Am I though? Left out. That's what a rational person would do. Not this guy. You have to understand the criminal mind. I hear they had to hide the Caldwin girl from him the whole time they were working with him. I heard they locked him in a cage and only let him out at night. Excuse me? Criminal mind, huh? So what's he doing now? Waiting. He's probably watching us right now. Oh, I Put am. Crazy mask on. Creeping closer and closer, ever closer until. Cut it out. What's so impressive about Cornbo anyway? Who's he got up again? Nice. <laughs> oh, you better be lucky I'm not an assassin, boys. He could never stand up to man with our train. Well, now I do hope he shows up. I want to see you run crying. Like you were the other night. 
was I supposed to do? Ooh, you better be lucky I'm not, I'm going for a non-lethal. Or I would have been like, closer and closer and then stab both of you. <laughs> and there and get hit by rocks. They were just kids. They were a gang. I hope Lord Regent Havelock sends the tall boys in to level the place. It's going to be a new era. Having a 10-year-old on the throne isn't going to be a good play. High Overseer Martin says it well. He says we were cursed when the Empress died by Corvo's black magic. And the rats are never going to leave until we had a real called one back. He says the outsiders followed. So there's someone rocking around out there's there, some too. some curse on this city. That's Havelock. Ooh. I'm still trying to forget working in the flooded dip. Don't oh, there is a rune here. Before we this go, one. I'm going to stash a few bottles of wine from the cellar. Take them out of here with us. Just make sure Corvo's not hiding down there first. Maybe you're right about that. Uh oh. There's even people up there. Uh oh. That guy's coming back though. Can they no see me in, drink in bushes? Night, another patrol with you. Man. Well, good thing they won't be coming up here. Ow! Okay, so. I thought it would be logical to be able to hide in a bush but apparently bushes don't make sense see him coming into the bathroom because that would be weird. The doors to be right there. Okay, so he doesn't come in this way. But that's great, I guess. Okay, hold on. Now that I'm inside, let me save again. Yeah, this is the part that I was dreading. Well, not dreading, but the part that when I was thinking about playing this game again, I was just like, oh, it's going to be this part. prototype oh they cleared this room out well I guess so because they plan on moving you know moving out of here okay that chain goes further down yeah they move all their stuff out oh my heart is beating Okay, so it's in the next room then? Where is that? Did they build like a tower? Those would be on... I think those are the people on my floor. Then... Yeah, they're on my floor. Well, it looks like they have two prisoners outside still. <laughs> Unfortunately, though...
I don't think there's too much of an opportunity except when he. Are you peeing in my room? Ooh, I'm gonna get you. Come back over here so I can yeah, strangle you. know if there's any real good place to keep them right now. Uh oh. Are you coming this way too? I'm gonna go down. Cause I don't think people are going into those old rooms. So those would probably be the best place for me to put bodies in for now. Are you coming up? No. So they're coming down. Why are you guys backing up for? What? What's going on? It's, it's like it was like, no, you go. No, you go. No, after you. No, after you. Yeah, there should be no reason for them to come in here. Oh great, they're splitting up. Great. Ha <laughs> You should have never split it off. Whew. Ooh, that tall boy scared me. Now he should be all the way down. Probably out. Oh, we got a, a mission clue, didn't we? Many city watchmen remain standing. Well, I mean, yeah. Uh, optional find half lake or some clue to his plans. Make contact with Piero and Sokolov inside the workshop. Enter the shop through the riverside balcony. Okay. Okay. I got rid of one guard, so now it should just be this one over here. Uh, where's the room? Oh, that's in Piero's office then. Workshop, I should say. Do you think 
that someone would come in here and find the body. Uh, let's just go. Let me just put it back where I want to put it. shooting at I thought I saw some people coming Yeah, because there's no windows on this floor, on these floors. A letter from Emily Carvo. Remember before when I mentioned a special drawing I was working on for you? This is it. I don't know where you went, but I hope when you get back you see this and like it. I'd like to take it to Donwell Tower with us. Everyone's acting strange tonight. Samuel was whispering to Callista about a flare launcher that she was supposed to use to call him. He told her to lock the door to my old tower. I heard the Admiral tell the others we are leaving tonight for a place called the Lighthouse on Kingsborough Island. I hope you get back before then, Emily. So they probably turned her uh, told Emily that like I went on the, a mission or something. So that's the guy that's watching that part. Okay. Piero's workshop. Callista Havlick. I need to ca take care of the one that's watching this area here. Because I think it's the only one here. I don't know what that noise is, and I don't like it. Like, are they just shooting randomly or something? Did someone find bodies? Oh, they shouldn't have found them. Uh-oh. No, he's not coming up. He's going back around. I need him to come over here on this edge where uh where it's less likely that I would be spotted by one of those tall boys. Or not. Okay. I should be able to just leave him here and close the door. Nah, I'm not putting you where my bed is. Someone coming up? What? I know you're here somewhere, Did someone see me?
interesting. Maybe they just spotted like my toe or something. Oh, they saw the they saw the bodies. Well, now they're on the lookout. Maybe they won't come all the way up here. Okay, good. Alright, so they get this in my, the bodies, which is weird. I thought I closed the door. I thought I closed the door. Are they gonna try to wake him up again? Well, whatever. Okay, where to... Okay, we have already determined that's in Peril's workshop, so... Okay, so... Callista, Peril's workshop... Havelock. Okay. Okay, so they should not be able to see me from up here. And actually, this is the only. Yeah, I know. It's me. Do I have the key? Corvo, I can't believe you're alive. Yep, it's me. Everyone, Corvo. They everyone to cover it all up. Oh. Then they took Emily with them and they left. I couldn't do anything to protect her. Please find her. Make her safe. No problem. All his talk of being an honorable military man. But Havelock will use Emily like a puppet to his own advantage. Something changed in the Admiral as soon as the Lord Regent died. It had been building up. Martin was acting strange, going quiet if any of us were near. Whispering late into the night with Havelock and Pendleton while you were out doing the real work. I think they realized they were one step away from holding the same position the Lord Regent had. And worried they'd be held accountable for what they did here, as the Loyalists. They would have killed me too, but Havelock spared me. Out of respect for my uncle, I believe. Please. Talk to Samuel and the others. Someone must know where they're going. Find Emily. She's suffered through so much and she's got no one else on her side except you. Samuel set this here in case you returned. You can use it to call him. He said he'd come quickly. Hopefully there's a place he can dock where the watch won't see him. So we don't do that yet. The city watch is everywhere out there. Yeah, I know. But I don't even care if they find me anymore. I saw Samuel on the river earlier. I'm sure he'll take you to Emily. One last trip, I expect. I wonder how much this thing would have changed, like if we just straight up killed I everyone. Take care of Emily. Letter to Callista. Fret night not. I believe there is still hope for Emily and Dodwall. I don't believe Carvo is gone. I'll be searching the river for him, but if you catch wind of him, shoot up a flare using the launcher I place in Emily's tower. I'll make my way back as quickly as I can. Keep this tower locked and take care of yourself. Emily is gonna need you when this is over. Samuel. I tried as best I could. I wonder when he had time to set up the flare. Like, maybe what, Go after him. when he himself was like, I dude, really there's some weird stuff this, going on. If, they were willing to kill to if, depending on where he is, I probably can get it from here. Like, come back up and go there. Okay. So, now we have to go to Piro. Let me just make sure. Or some clue to his plans. Uh, make contact with Piro. Okay, so good thing that Piro is not dead. Um, we should be able to make it from here. 
Oh, they set up barricades and everything. I need to converse with someone on my own level. Couldn't agree more. Your expulsion from the academy was a crime against natural philosophy. One out of one. Which you might have pointed out at the time. But it's pointless to hold a grudge. Is this a new one? I want to ask. Well, you. I knew it was too good to be true. I need to see some conspiracy trying to be a hero for your own game. But they I can't have recruit from prisons as you and delivered to me an ally but it's almost me as to work brilliant as myself. Old Sokolov and I will pull up here and deliver the bullets against the ruffians outside. But I think our approaches may reinforce each other. This is what we've been lacking. Um, I think I'm going to read it a little bit on this one. Well, I knew it was too good to be true. Seems that the conspiracy tried to use Opero for their own gain and then discard him. But they have erred and delivered to me an ally almost as friendly as myself. Old Sokolov and I will hole up here until we can blast the ruffians outside and make for the academy. Okay. Anyone in here? Well, that's good that they hold up. Maybe that's what they're shooting. Like, they're shooting this. Because they, you know, turn on all the shutters and all that. Kind of making it a safe haven, really. Oh, they're hiding under tape. Although, would you see that you still breathe? The Hi. city would not be the same if you were not with us. I've completed Piero's work on an arc pylon, but only just. With this device, we can send a powerful electrical signal through the nervous system, merely rendering our enemies unconscious, or they can be reduced to ashes. I've attuned it so that we will be safe from the functions of the device. Oh, that's why I didn't they attack me. In the presence of our enemies. This arc pylon is more powerful than the older design. It will function at a greater range, striking down our foes while ignoring us. Okay. I need my final sequence, which is recorded in the blueprint for this device. Havelock was inspecting it before the killing started. Return the blueprint to me. It was in his bedroom before he left. Oh, I think I got it. It's still there. No, I got it already. Yeah. Pylon is complete. Now to activate it. With this device, we can send a powerful electrical signal through the nervous system, merely rendering our enemies unconscious. Yes, I or prefer that one. Reduced to ashes. Unconscious. Unconscious, please. Burn them. <laughs> Put them all to sleep. As you wish, Corvo, we will be far away before any of them regain their senses. Well, it's still a cutscene. All is ready, Corvo. All that remains is plugging in a whale oil tank to power it. Will you do the honors? Okay. This arc pylon is charged. No one will dare come near us. Okay, so hold on. Let me see what the crests are. Find a like or some clue to his plans. Uh. Because Havlock is probably find Havlock or some clue to his plans, but that's primary task. So I think I can do this because I feel like it will make it easier to get to them. Wait, what was optional? And the siege, safety of the two natural, make contact with Piero. Um, enter the shop. Did that optional? Incapacitate every guard on the premises yourself. Oh, like as far as like me using my own skill, which I prefer not, so. I'd rather take them out. I mean, this thing to take them out. But 
But I am going to save just in case. Because it's an optional one. So I feel like it would just make me fight in Havelock easier to do. But if not, you know. Oh crap, I passed it. Hold on, sorry. I passed it. And I feel like I did this last time too. Wait, did I pass it? No, it should be down there. Excuse me? Oh, I think I have to do three of them. Plugging in the whale oil tank. Ah, right, right. Don't shoot me, please. <laughs> I think there's three of them. Yeah, because it says receptacles. So there's going to be more that I have to take up there. And I think I remember seeing like three of them, I think. The escapist. <laughs> Did someone die? Unexpected. Ooh. Hold on. Actually, before I do that again, I know you're here. before I try that again, let me actually see. Because it's up there. And I can't warp when I have those things in my hand so because it has me go this way nope <laughs> oh wrong place Man, I'm glad you guys closed this place up. Or this would suck. Got to wait for them to cool themselves. So, we go this way. Oh, we go up. Okay. And yes, there are three. Okay. Got 
No, you don't. Is that them trying to, um, okay, I'm going to leave that there, I'm going to take this one, and I'm also going to save. <laughs> Actually, I'm also going to take a quick break as well, so I'll be right back. Alright, I am back. So, I now know where I'm going. Oh crap, I can't use the thingy so I can't see if the guy is here or not. He is. I was able to, was going to be able to make it if I noticed this at first. Oh, they are trying to hit the thing. Why can't I open these? <laughs> right, I noticed that. needed one ah I'm also unconscious simply amazing it functioned beyond my greatest expectations okay only a few city watchmen remain stand standing oh only a few Okay, fine, Havelock. It defies description. A device like this will ensure Dunwall's security. So I wonder who's left. Where's Havelock? Well, Havelock is knocked unconscious, so let's go. Well, eh, I'll do it after I. It's just that I don't want to assume. Havelock. One more floor down? So wait, who's left then? I guess anyone who was not on... The floor? You're not Havelock. Have life's orders to the guard. Captain Manning, we've tracked the conspiracy to the Hound Piss Pub. Search the premises for the natural philosopher Piero Joplin and Anton Sokolov. Do what you must to secure all materials related to the enhanced arc pylon they have been constructing. Question them thoroughly, and once you are certain you have everything they know of the pylon, execute them both. Bring the pylon to me, along with his papers and recordings. They may be two of the greatest minds of our age, but they're also traitors who conspired with Carvo to bring down this empire. I'm Keeper Empress Emily Caldwin with me at the lighthouse on King Sparrow Island until we're certain that Carvo and his fellow conspirators have been properly dealt with. Lord Regent Havelock. Okay. 
Like, are you sure it's just some of them? Drill on notice. Be on watch for members of the conspiracy. Some are still at large. If discovered, they are to be killed on sight. Move the bodies into the kennel, but they are not to be otherwise tempered with. Peril Joplin, missing, interrogate, then execute. Anton Sokolov, missing, interrogate, then execute. Lydia Brooklyn, found dead. Wallace Higgins, found dead. Carvel Atano, believed dead. Assume missing, kill on sight. Samuel Bisworth, missing, kill on sight. The woman in tower is uh, Callista Carnell and a victim of circumstance. Merely in the wrong place at the wrong time. Do not disturb her, but do not allow her to leave the premises. She is under my protection. Lord Regent Havelock. So they won't even hurt her regardless. I got your bow. Ooh. So what would be... Like, I'm thinking that if I didn't take care of, like, people on the top floor, maybe they would have been fine. Maybe, is what I'm thinking. Now it should just be get out of there. Yeah, use the fire. So, I don't know. Maybe if I manage to not get anyone. Interesting. Oh, this is a new one? Okay, this is the same one. You guys are all lucky that I am a nice person. Or you guys would have been dead. Like, to be- like, really? It says some, but it really just looks like it's now all. Wallace? Note to Wallace. My dear Wallace, we are departing for a safe and secure place where we can coordinate the transition of power to ourselves. Make certain that my audiograph and the best of the wines may make it aboard the vessel before the sun sets. This evening, the staff will be rewarded for their loyalty and service. Lord Pendleton. Oh, well. So it didn't happen like that. I can get in here. Yeah. There's no point. Alright. Uh, what would be an easy way to get up there? Yeah. It really just looks like everyone is now gone. Yeah, maybe if I did that before I even, t like, if I literally just snuck by all the guards, maybe. I expect that you will want to take revenge on those who wronged you. I do not know where they went, but it was by water. Old Samuel would know, I'd wager. We once discussed a system of signals to be used in Emily's tower for communication across the river. I wonder if he remembers that. He does. I'll make what you need as long as I have the necessary materials. Oh my god, suck love! Ooh, stink, stinky grenade. Ooh, and approved armor. Let's get the approved armor. And get this.
Sticky grenade. At this point, I'm just buying stuff. Just to buy it. of bullets. Well, Corvo, I hope we can be considered colleagues again. You were condemned, I was kidnapped. Men like us rise above such things. As to the good Admiral, I believe men such as Havelock start with high-minded intentions. Same with Martin, and maybe even Pendleton, though I suspect he was just lazy. But no one is prepared for the sheer seductive influence of being so close to real power. True. Once you start ordering people killed to get your way, everything else is mere detail. I return to my work now, and you to yours. Killing people, I mean. I sincerely hope it goes well. <laughs> well, I don't really kill people, but I'm going to say goodbye, Piero. Goodbye, Corvo. I wish to apologize for what was done to you. It seems that holding all the pieces and standing a step from the throne changed something in the others. Something I don't understand. Don't underestimate Havelock, Corvo. He'll be waiting. Well, let's go. Uh... Everyone's unconscious. Like, literally, everyone's unconscious. I feel like people would be running around like, what in the world just happened? I'm here. Like her, like... Now that you've eliminated the City Watch, I can find my way out of here. But there's no way I can help Emily the way you can. I saw Samuel on the river earlier. I'm sure he'll take you where you need to go. One last trip, I expect. Okay, that's the same. Use the flare launcher. I'll be okay here. Just go. Well, I know you'll be fine. Just make sure. Well, where is he? I thought I'd be able to see his boat at least. Woo. Or maybe he's over there by that beach. Woo! Not the water. Not the water. Get me up. Oh, great. It's probably over there. Like that one beach that I was trying to. that I found. Yep. Because that's the, you know, one that's all, all the way out of the way. Thought I'd find you here. It never pays to bet against you, does it? I saw the signal. I knew you'd be back, Corvo. I knew it. We'll need to get out of here soon. The Admiral controls the military now, Martin's high overseer, and Pendleton's in favor with the aristocracy and Parliament. They need Emily, of course. But if Havelock senses that it's all about to fall down around him, who knows what he's liable to do? We're going to Kingsbury Island. Wait here. No, let's go. Good. Then it's one more trip across the river to where it meets the sea. That's where the Lord Regent was building his new lighthouse. Ought to be something to see. Is the mission? Yay! The mission is over. Just in time too. Um. So three bodies, which were we know what bodies those were. Low chaos, didn't kill anyone, used the art pylon to rescue Piero and Sokolov, found Emily's drawing. So we got one out of one rooms, there was no bone charms, no outsider uh, shrines, no paintings, and hardly any money. So, um, but I'm just gonna let it load so I can save and then we can call it it for the episode. 
This is it, sir. I suspect Half-Lock Martin and Lord Pendleton landed there a while ago and went into the lighthouse. Knowing them, they're not giving up without a fight. No worry, I still won't kill them. Admiral and Martin talking about this place is where they'd hold up if they had to. Anybody going in has to breach the fort and the gatehouse. And there's only one way to the top. Mm. All I can say is that it's been a pleasure serving with you. Maybe after all this is settled, we'll see each other again. I'm just glad you got away, Samuel. Because I don't know how I would have gotten here. Good luck, Corvo. If anyone deserves it, you do. Oh, thank you. Give my best to Emily. After she's on the throne, she won't have time for an old man like me. I knew you were sharp, Corvo. But somehow you managed to get through all this mess without losing sight of what really matters. For that, I respect you. I wonder how I much that would have changed if you killed Too people. Many good people here to let it all turn to ashes. I'd best be going. The battlefield's no place for an old sailor like me. That time is long past. Good luck, my friend. So he he just hightails it out. But what I was saying um, is that I wonder how much of the conversations would change, like if you actually killed people, and I mean like everyone around you, but not you know like all the assassin uh, the missions, like if you would have killed everyone. Lighthouse, fort. Yep, pretty simple. But anyway. So we are going to save. So if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do. Enjoy the rest of your day or your night. And this is Kijigo signing out. Goodbye, everyone.